Hello everyone. Hope you all are fine. Today on our behalf of CCTV desk, we come up with new video. This video is all about a very important app. So basically this is our second video in app series. So in this video we are going to describe you, we are going to discuss with you what is GC Mob app and both for Android device and iOS device but in this video this is video is especially for iPhone or um, iOS devices so basically in iPhone it is also known name named as IC mob for mobile app okay so in this video we are going to describe you that what actually the GC mob app is what are its feature and functions and then after that we'll tell you that how you installed how you get the uh, software and how you installed on your phone and after that how you configure the software to make the camera live and able to access all its feature so keep watching please like share our video and subscribe to our channel if you are a new one and please press the bell icon if so that you get the all the upcoming notifications of upcoming videos so keep watching now basically gc mob app is a app which is used to connect as well as control the ccb camera on mobile it is also used to monitor the cameras over the on remote location over the internet and gc mob mobile app or ic mob mobile app is one of the best app to watch your ccb camera on your pc this app allow not only the monitoring but also can manage your dvr nvr or ip camera by using this gc mob app this software is a powerful tool for managing your CCTV device on your PC and so let's start how you get the file and how you install in your phone and how you configure to make the camera live so first thing you should do you should search for the app store in iOS okay so here is my app store just I just open my app store and here you find the search option just click on the search and here you should click on GC mob right when you click on this you find on the top of the list ic mob so in i in, in ios or apple devices it is named as ic mob and what should you do you just click on this get when you click on this it asks for your permission just double click to install now it is installing okay it will take a few minutes to completely install the software once it is installed you find the open button on the on this app store just click on the open button so here it's allow you ask you the question just click out click on allows once or allow while using the app whatever you want and it asks for to access your photos so you can give the permissions you you may not give the permission it's all totally depend on you okay and again so notifications it allow for setting again you should click on allow and just after that what you want to add either you want to add camera or the door phone so in my case i use a camera so just click on camera and click next okay basically this is the interface of the software the first thing you should do you should click on this three dot on the corner just click on this and after that you should click on the device manager that click click on the device manager and after that here on the top of the right corner you should find a plus video icon just click on this when you click on this it asks for a many option like wi-fi devices wired devices device initialization cloud service devices okay so if you have a Wi-Fi camera like EasyCam and all that, then you should click on Wi-Fi. Otherwise, you should click on the wired devices like uh, traditional camera and DVR. So I just just click on this and just again click on the next. When I is you can here you find a lot of options like install on an IP domain. If you have a static IP, you just you 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 should click on just simply enter the IP domain. The, in my case, I just enable my device to install on. Just click on the install on. When I click on the install on so it will ask for a name and a serial number and username and password so these are name you should put anything and username serial number and password this all are devices means the device you are adding like dvr and whatever you are adding you should 
enable the install on service on your uh, devices and after that you should click log, log in onto the network option you should you find any everything just note down that thing or just you if you have a uh, that you have in front of your dvr or nvr just uh, just click on this barcode again click on allow you simply do this okay and if you have if you uh, and otherwise you should enter the manual the serial number so i just enter manual the serial number so that you can you know everything so just put anything like here i just click on the test device and whatever in this name you put anything whatever you if, uh, you remember easily and here it asks for a serial number so i put a serial number here and it is asked for username and the password username i entered and the pass it asked for password please note that this all our device I mean device you are adding and just click done and just click start live view now it totally depend on your network that you see that it comes too fast because it's totally depend on the network uh, like in my case my internet service and the both end is very fast so it connect within a second here you find a lot of option like here you find this view like four camera view and nine camera view just click on this okay so again click on the four camera view and just double click any camera you find uh, again you here in the, in the uh, in in this below here you find a screenshot option i just click on the screenshot and here you find the video record option just click on the video record option so it will start on the recording and you in in this case you find many options okay now again just click on the home so again click next here the camera is live here you find a test device and you can put anything okay and here you find a live preview option just click on this and you can select anything like this and you find the many option like that okay and if you want to check uh, recording playback then you should click on the playback option and just click on the device and here you find all the things like uh, what what kind of recording you want so i just click on all and just here it, it's a test device just click on this you if you want any cam like just click on any cam and when you click on this it will take time again you see that it is available like that and here you find the uh, orange like second and again you find just click on this again you find the recording just here you want to uh, change the date according to your choice like this and click ok so here you should change again and change the so just just click on this and click on the touch device and click on any cam and just here you find that your device is has recording is here okay so you can choose according to your time frame and here you see that it it, it should show me uh, around 7 1723 to 1725 so you can choose according to your need and here you find the cut option here you find the screenshot and many more so hope you understand well just how you add the device and how you get the app and how you play back that the video so this is all for this gc mob 
और आई सी मॉब ऐप फॉर आई ओ एस एंड सो थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग एंड प्लीज़ सब्सक्राइब